Hey everybody, I'm Laura from Hair Hardware and today we're going to make this really cute four loop tails down bow. It takes just a couple minutes and it turns out real cute. So let's go ahead and get started. For this bow I'm using 36 inches of one and a half inch grow grain ribbon. This is garden rose color. And to help make the bow symmetrical, I'm going to make a mark every six inches. Use this ruler to help guide me here. And you don't need a huge mark. I'm kind of using a big um, black marker for this so that you can see it on the camera, but you really only need a tiny little pencil mark or something just to help keep each loop proportional and size right. You're going to go across the whole length of the ribbon and you can adjust this more or less depending on the width of the ribbon that you're using and how wide you want the loops to be. When you're done you'll have six dots on your ribbon and when you fold your ribbon in half you're going to have one dot that's going to fall in the crease. Take a pin and stick it through the center on your dot. Then take one side, pierce it through the pin like this, take the other side, do the same thing. You can see your bow taking shape. And then you're going to take this side, bring it up like this, And then your last piece, bring it over and cross it. So when you're done, you should end up with ribbon that looks like this. This will be the front and this will be the back. This has some straight pieces. This has the cross on the front. Now leave the pin in place so that nothing slides and you don't lose your shape. Take a salon clip and clamp right in the center. You can have the pin sticking up right through the middle. And then what you're going to do is you're going to check your loops. You're going to make sure that everything looks right. You don't have one like way askew from the other. And flip it over. Make sure that the back, that this straight piece is still straight. Straighten it out if you need to. So basically you're just checking your loops, making sure that everything looks the way you want it to. When you're happy with how it all looks, you can take the pin out, but leave it in the salon clip, and then you're going to take quarter inch sheer ribbon to tie the center. It'll give you a nice crease. Flip the salon clip over and make sure that you're tying off on the back. Pull the ribbon tight, give it a couple knots to hold it secure. And then you can take it out of the salon clip and you'll see you have a nice crease in the center. You can also sew the center, that's another way to go about that. It really is your, your choice how, how you want to go about that. Both turn out nicely. So now that we have the bow done, you have your four loops and your two tails are going down. You're going to trim the back of the bow tying ribbon off. You don't need that anymore. Now we're going to add a center to the bow. And I'm using this glittery velvet ribbon. So to put the center on, you need to put glue on the back of the bow. Put one end of your ribbon on there and then wrap it around. You only need about three inches or so, just so just a real small piece works. If you have extra on the back, trim that off and then glue down the last bit. That will secure your center. 
we're going to trim the tails now and I'm going to do a um, dovetail. So just fold the ribbon in half and cut on an angle. Do the same thing for the other side. And now because these ends are cut and exposed, you're going to want to heat seal those. So use a wood burner, start in the center of the dovetail and work your way out. That will keep a nice angle in the middle of the dovetail and it won't be curved. Okay, the bow is almost done. We just need to add a clip to it. I'm going to add a partially lined single prong alligator clip to the back of the bow. I'm using four and a half inches of three eighths of an inch grosgrain ribbon and I'm using D670 double sided tape. This tape makes lining clips very quick and easy. You don't have to worry about bumpy glue from the glue gun or anything like that. You put the tape on, the, on your ribbon and it has paper on one side so you peel it off, open up your clip, put it on the inside, make sure all the paper is off, and then bring it around to the top, press it down, push it in the spring, and then along the back of the clip. It's that easy. Now to add it to the back of the bow, add a strip of hot glue, flip the clip over, and just glue it straight on the back. Press it on there, make sure it's secure and you're all done. You've made a really cute four loop tails down bow.